Hey everybody, welcome back and thanks for clicking in. Today we're looking at an amazing house on the South Shore with a view of the South Shore. This is a three bedroom, three bath with a one bedroom, one bath apartment, a well, a pool, and like I said, a beautiful South Shore view. It's not often a house like this comes along. This is your chance to jump on it. Right off the neighborhood road and into the property. Now this driveway comes in this way, curves around the South side and then comes out down on the East side of the property. So you do have a big circular driveway. Awesome trees. Check out, this is a uh, small leaf bay leaf tree. Man, you take one of these, oh my God, so fragrant. Put that in your red sauce, you'll be like loving it. And then here we've got some bananas getting ready to come out. There's a hand there that's just coming out now. And then we got a mango tree. We've got a well over here. Not a lot of properties have wells. So if you wanted to do a big garden, you got plenty of space to do raised beds or a little greenhouse and all the water you could ever want comes out of that little well there. Currently not being utilized, but you could certainly fire it back up easy enough. Here we are looking at the house. We're sort of looking northeast. The pool is here. There's a guest apartment on this side, and then the main house is there. And again, this driveway wraps around to the left, right by those neem, that row of neem trees, and then back out to the road where we started the video. But just look at the size of the yard. I mean, if you're having a party or a... You know, you wanted to put up a volleyball court or whatever. I mean, this thing is huge. Tons of space. Tons of parking. And then you got a 22 kilowatt propane generator right under the pool deck here. So, and lots of storage as well. All right, let's head up the steps and into the house. Check it out. Okay, we land up on this beautiful Trex deck. Notice the Trek runs all the way around the pool under all this cupboard space, past the front door, past the guest suite, and then here you've got a little cool toy storage nook, or a perfect spot actually for a uh, grill. But check out this pool. Fiberglass pool, all in super good condition. Got a robot down there working hard to keep it clean. Nice steps at an angle there, at a 45 degree angle, easy access, and then check out the view of the South Shore. Beautiful, looks out over Great Pond, the Boy Scout camp. Just a great view. Especially to have a flat lot with this kind of view, pretty uncommon. Because usually with a view, you've got to have some steep land. There's the door into the main house. There's the door into the guest suite, guest apartment. And then here's a bonus set of steps. So if you were living here, you know, you would park right here, come up these steps, straight into the house. Really nice setup. And then here's the master bedroom door, which has direct access to the pool. Also check out this drink reel. So if you're out hanging out by the pool and you want to sit down and drink at night or what day or whatever, there you go. Lots of room to lay it out and not have to worry about it falling over or somebody stepping on it. All right, let's head into the main house. Check that out first and then we'll head over and check out the guest apartment. All right, right off the pool patio. Here's the dining room. Here's the pass-through to the kitchen, which is a real nice feature if you're having meals there. And then check out those arches that frame out the living room. Beautiful. And then down to the bedrooms this way. We'll go there in a minute. But the size of this living room is awesome. Beautiful tile runs throughout the house, all nice and new and clean. Two-ton AC unit there. Imagine Super Bowl on a big screen or movie night right there. It'd be awesome. And here we are looking back out at the pool patio through the arches and then over to the kitchen. Beautiful kitchen. Epoxy resin countertops. I mean, this stuff is like indestructible. Fantastic, especially you have a lot of, you know, a big family and a lot of abuse. These things can take it. All of the doors and cabinetry have the slow closers, which I love. There's no slam in the cabinets. Corner cabinet with a spinner basket there. Lots of storage, double sink. And then check this out. You have your normal faucet, right? And then you've got this purified water faucet. The water coming out of this faucet is ultra purified. In addition to the normal house filters, you've got this system down below, which is making that 100% drinkable. Very nicely laid out, very spacious. This is a four person kitchen, easily. Looking back at the living room and the goings on. Now, there's also a nice feature with these pantry closets on this side of the fridge, these pull out. So if you're doing spices or whatnot, you've got two of these here on the right side and also over on the left side as well. Nice stainless steel fridge, dishwasher, 
I mean, this kitchen's fully equipped and ready to rock and roll. And then you got additional pantry space with your full-size washer dryer here right off the kitchen. Your electrical panels are here, utility sink, more cabinetry for storage, and then you've got your solar hot water system. I mean, everywhere you turn around, there's another bonus in this house. It's just so well appointed. All right, that's this end of the house. Now let's head over to the bedrooms. But before we do, I just want to show you, it's got an alarm system. So, you know, if you need to activate that, you certainly can do it. And then here you've got an extra storage room with your cistern cover. This is a nice big room. Nice having your cistern cover in a separate room because if you have to have someone come in and do some maintenance or cleaning, they're not messing up the house at all. They're inside this separate little storage room. But that's a big storage closet. I mean, you could fit a paddleboard in there easily. Okay, that's this side of the house. Now we're gonna head into the master bedrooms and then we'll hit the guest bedrooms next. Here we go. Straight into the master bedroom. Nice big room. Lots of glass, lots of windows to open for breeze. Direct access to the pool so that morning splash is always tempting you. And then you've got this beautiful South Shore view that runs the whole length of this side of the room. Love it. Big open wide space here, perfect for a workstation or an office desk. If you want to set something up along there, you got outlets and power. That's a no brainer. And then into the bedroom area itself, you've got a walk-in closet here, more vented windows above, AC if you don't want to go for the breeze, and then the ensuite bath here. Granite vanity, super nice detail on the tile work. Love that and then a nice glass shower. Notice this uh, fancy schmancy stainless steel shower with multiple jets, super cool. And then up above, we've got the tongue and groove ceilings. Just a nice detail, gives it a nice homey feel. And then we'll head back out. Here's your workspace if you wanted it to be. And then immediately to the right, we've got guest bedroom number one. Again, another big room. Vented windows, AC, the same beautiful tile throughout. And then looking back, the ensuite bath, dual closets, one left, one right. Now, this bath services this as an ensuite, but it also doubles as a guest bath. So, if you're entertaining, this can be opened up and it'll get you straight back out to the living room kitchen area. Otherwise, it's an ensuite for this bedroom alone. And then here you've got a beautifully tiled shower. Actually got sort of a tub, a tiled tub situation that you could utilize. And again, more of the vented windows for maximum ventilation. Fantastic guest bath. Come back around, there's the storage room. Into guest bedroom number two. Another big room, almost really a dual room. This could almost be a mother-in-law's suite. If you want to do that as a closeout and do an outside door, you could make this a little apartment. There's enough room to put a little kitchenette in it. You've got your vanity, you've got your shower, you've got your toilet. I mean, this is a massive, it's almost like a little apartment, really. It just doesn't have the kitchen. Okay, that's the bedrooms. We've seen the kitchen, living room, and dining. Now we're gonna head back out to the pool deck, bank or right, and we're gonna go into the uh, guest suite and apartment. Okay, back out to the pool patio. Taking this awesome view just one more time. Look at that pool. Can you imagine it's January and you can go swimming in a pool. It's like 80 degrees. It's awesome. All right, before we head into the apartment, I just wanted to show you these shutters. You see these, uh, these are storm fabric that rolls down, connects to these bolts, and they're located above every single window opening throughout the entire house, all the way around the front, the side, and the back. So easy peasy for storm prep. Straight into a full service kitchen, gas stove and oven, micro, double sink, beautiful, I can never say that brand, refrigerator. And then you've got a alarm system right here. This alarm is tied into the main house alarm as well. So you can set just this unit, both units and vice versa over there, which is a real nice feature to have that ability in case you've got a multifamily situation or if it's a rental, they can have their own separate alarm. And then here we are into the living room area, more beautiful tongue and groove. And then into the bedroom itself. 
gorgeous mahogany doors for the closet, framed out with more of the tongue and groove. And then here's your ensuite bath, just beautiful. Everything is in fantastic condition. More gorgeous tile, like new shower and vanity, just beautiful. And then into the bedroom itself here, I'll stand off in the corner and give you a little panorama. Notice you got the AC. Bed would likely go there. You got dual outlets for your side tables. And I noticed you got a 220 outlet here. So the kitchen's on the other side of that, the sink. So you could run a hot and cold line in here and easily put in a little laundry closet for a stacked unit or side by side. I think I'd do stacked right there. Perfect setup for have a in apartment laundry. So that's it, everybody. Appreciate you taking a look. Hope you like it. If you're stateside and want to check it out, give us a call. If you live on St. Croix, give us a call. Love to show it to you. This place has it all in a price point you can't beat. And really love to make it yours. For this Norfolk Pine and me, for now we say goodbye and have a great St. Croix day. Bye-bye.